Hi everyone, Petal is blessed here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on today to share with you guys some fun DIYs you can do using Dollar Tree mirrors. Okay everyone, I'm going to share with you the items that we'll be using for our fun filled DIYs today. Okay, I found some new candle holders at the Dollar Tree and they have a mercury glass effect. I think they look really nice. This one's like a silver with a like a grayish blackish tone and it's very nice and they also have it in the gold the gold looks very nice too eh, you guys and that's the inside and then we have these little birds here they're all white they're very nice and of course we have our candle holders and our round mirrors and some of the oxagon mirrors also and we have our flower bling wrap we have our gems from Walmart and we have our two bling wraps gold and silver from totally dazzled all right everyone these are the items that we'll be using today so let's get started Okay, we're going to start by just adding some of our bling wrap across the top of our candle holder. And now for our gold candle holder, we're going to add some of our we're going to add some of our gems from Walmart going across the top portion of the candle holder also. Now for the base of our candle holders, we'll be blinging it out with some more bling wrap going around the top. And now we're going to add some strips going down the sides. Just some single strips that I cut and then we're just going to glue them down going all the way around. And for this candle holder, we're going to use our flower bling wrap going right around the top part. <laughs> and now we have our cute little bird and we're going to use the gems that you can get from Walmart or Dollarama. And we're going to decorate his tail and his wings. Just bling them out with the gems, like, let him look more appealing. <laughs> Now that our bird is all blinked out and our candle stand, we're going to take our three pieces and put them together to make our fun and cute little home decor. You can use E6000 you guys, but I'll be using just a hot glue gun for today. And now for our candle stand, we're going to glue our pieces together just like we did before for our cute little bird decor we're doing it for our candle holders and like I said you can use your E6000 your tacky glue any kind of self adhesive you would like to use for this project for a more permanent hold and here's our finished look for our cute home decor using the birds that we blinked out from the Dollar Tree I think they turned out very nice. It's a nice, refreshing little piece of home decor. You know, spring is coming soon. <laughs> and you'll be wanting to spruce up your home again. And this will make a lovely, and it's an easy DIY to do. It makes an eye-popping statement. Yes, it does. <laughs>
And here are candle holders, everyone. I think they look very nice. I did three different patterns to show you guys. And they're nice, simple, and easy to do. <laughs> and you could use the round mirrors or the octagon mirrors. And you can bling out the candle holders. The ones that we use for the base, you can leave them plain. And I did some in silver and some in gold. Three different styles for you guys to choose from. And I think they all look very nice. Here's everything all together, all of our fun DIYs for today. And I think they all look very nice. They turned out very nice. Nice and refreshing home decor for the spring season coming up. I like how they turned out. I think they look super cute. And I like this candle holder the best. The silver one with the silver mercury glass effect. And I like how the candle holders, the bottom parts are all blinked out. It's very nice. And I love the two birds. Absolutely beautiful. I think they all turned out very nice. Alright everyone, leave me a comment down below and tell me which one you like the best. <laughs> Although I think they all look very nice, but tell me which one stood out to you more. Let you say, wow, I like that. <laughs> yeah, And give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to press that like button. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and press that subscribe button so you can come back and see more of the DIYs that I come up with to share with you all. And as always, stay blessed from Tetel is Blessed. Bye-bye, everyone.